this is step two root canal treatment. Uh, we're going to talk about how uh, and what to prepare for root canal treatment number two. When we need to do root canal treatment, um, it means that the tooth has had severe enough damage that um, the damage has gone into the nerve that has caused infection or dying of the nerve inside the tooth. This is a root canal space, okay? It's basically a chamber that is uh, empty after the first stage of root canal treatments. And the purpose of root canal treatment stage two, which is a chemo mechanical, chemo mechanical preparation. Chemo means um, we are using some liquids, okay? Um, disinfectant liquids to clean the inside of the chamber. Mechanical means that we're going to use some mechanical tools, such as a, it's called files, but it's literally there is some some tools to clean the inside of the tooth uh, to make a smooth and uh, feelable feelable surface, so that we can save the tooth. So first of all, we would need to have local anesthetic. So I'll start with the uh, numbing gel. And then we'll go into uh, local anesthetic. After local anesthetic, we will need root, uh, rubber dam, rubber dam clamp, which is a ring that will go around the tooth. The ring that will go around the tooth. This is a very enlarged tooth, but in a normal size tooth, this is, will just go over the tooth to uh, to retain a rubber to isolate a tooth. All right. Uh, if you don't know what rubber dam is. Refer to our previous videos to that we talk about um, how to manage rubber dam. Okay, so in this in these videos in this section, Luisa has kindly prepared rubber dam clamp, rubber dam sheet, rubber dam holder, and the rubber dam forceps right here. Once we've got these initial bits prepared, we can also see that there's two pairs of uh, root canal files okay this is a pro taper system pro taper system and uh, if you do not know what size of a file to prepare in the normal circumstances i will prepare two types of file system one of it is 21 millimeters size 10 k files right here it's called a hand files it looks like this purple with a purple handle and i will prepare three uh, three colors of uh, pro taper file. I I've missing one uh, white white pro taper pro glider right here for the 21 millimeters area. But it would say right here 21 millimeters right here. Okay. So I will also prepare the 25 millimeters and it would say 25 millimeters right here and uh, with a different color. So it always go in a sequence of purple white yellow and red um, the, if you need one more um, if your doctor needs one more which is more than likely going to be blue all right so these are the two that you need to prepare and from here we have uh, two sets of burr one set of it is in purple coded this is the endodontic files uh, sorry endodontic burrs and this is this is a special golden burr that is long and is, it has non-cutting and uh, it protects the tooth, all right? And this is Gates Gleden, Gates Gleden. We need it for first and second step root canal treatments, and this is just a normal restorative burr kit. And in here, this is just a normal restorative kit, um, but you have an extra sharp uh, tools, okay? It's called DG16, DG16. We need it for every, every single step of root canal treatments. Apart from that, it will be uh, Milton EDTA uh, normal restorative high speed slow speed and endo handpiece and ultrasonic handpieces and the bird blocks to measure the millimeters of um, the length of the root canal treatments last but not least we have an apex locator the apex locator it tells us um, how long the internal surface of the root canal is, meaning um, from the top bit to the bottom, because that is to ensure that we've cleaned the entire length of the tooth. And we always we always have this, a, a little minor hook right here, and this is a, a file holder. So this will get attached to here. Okay, so this is 
uh, phase two root canal treatments.